as you can see here, I'm showing you my age spots. That's Vinci, the serum I put all over my face and my neck. I have an Avon roller for my skin. I do the upper part about 50 times. I do the lower part about 50 times. And then I repeat it on the other side. I also do the top of my forehead along with the side of my eyes and under my neck. Look for details of products at the end of my video. After I'm done with that, I add on a foundation, I'm sorry, a primer. And then I add on, as you can see right there, it's actually wet and wild dewy. So I apply it all around the sides with a brush. And then in the middle of my face, I use, I pat down the foundation. I've used a lot of foundation, um, real expensive foundation. And I've noticed that this one I've used is great. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you? How was your week? Did you have a great week? A great Thanksgiving? How are you today? I'm just trying to fix my lighting here. How is it going? I have some great things to tell you. Uh, remember the last video that I did, I um, was talking about, uh, my face looks really kind of oily right now with the lighting that I have. Um, but the last video I talked about was, um, if you wanted to do a low maintenance like makeup routine and have it be inexpensive, by all means, if you've gotten to find that right foundation or that right lipstick or that right mascara that you searched for for years, remember that? Like you'd go through so many and I'm sure that the makeup that we, that you did, you tried stayed in your, you know, don't use makeup draw and it's really hard for you to throw it away. <laughs> well, this is this. I mean, at the same time, it's like, okay, um, if you're using something and you finally got it, that's fine, use it. But if you're still out there and you want to go for like a little bit more of a different look or something like, say you're in a, you want to get ready really quick and you want to um, do a low maintenance like makeup tutorial. You don't have the time where you have to do all the, you know, people always have, um, like Kim Kardashian does a lot of um, makeup tutorials with uh, her contour sticks. And um, I hardly ever use contour. Sometimes I do, um, but it depends on what, I don't know, if I have enough time to spend on that kind of makeup, you know, um, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyways, you see I'm shiny right now. This is actually, um, this is kind of like a dewy uh, setting spray, actually. I've never used setting spray in the last couple months. I got setting spray from Avon, and um, so I'm trying a bunch of them out, and I really like this one because even though I do look shiny on camera to you right now, if you see me in person in real life, my skin looks glowing. But um, this is it, this is called Milani, it, and it's actually um, Make It Dewy, and it's really cool. Um, right now, it does, like I said, it, it does look shiny, um, but it does give the appearance of like a glowing look. Um, but for like a makeup look, like say I have on right now, I just did this makeup like about five minutes ago, so excuse me, um, and my hair needs to be done. Anyways, <laughs> uh, what I actually found out was, I mean, I've used foundations for years, right? And um, I really couldn't find the right one because as I've gotten older, I can see like as I put it on, um, the cakiness and like you'll see the cakiness around your lips and, and around your eye area. And then I noticed that if you put this, I learned this from another trick on, on TikTok actually. Um, once she puts her foundation on, um, she takes her, her setting spray and she takes her hand and she sprays it on the hand like that. And then she taps it all around here and it totally takes away all that like creepy look that you have in your eye. So that was a tip that I just learned like two months ago. I just learned that about that. So yeah, if you haven't tried setting spray, it's amazing. Not only if you don't want to put it on, that's fine, but just to take away, if you're older, to take away that creepiness around your eye area. So I totally recommend doing this. And I really love this product, Milani. Um, and you spray it on and it just gives you that glowing feeling. 
and um, I have a link to this um, um, below on Amazon. It'll take you right to it. It's really inexpensive. I think I bought this for like $5.99 or $6.99. Don't quote me, but this is amazing. Uh, like I said before, I've used a lot of foundations and I've tried to find the right one. I really like Laura Mercier and that's like a high end, um, really quality product. But say you're just kind of like going through all these foundations and then like you're saying, I can't, this month I can't afford to spend 55 or $60 on Laura Mercier. And I started to read reviews a lot. You have to read reviews on Amazon. So I started to look at these foundations. I'm looking like, you know, on and online, I, I uh, Googled like mature skin, what's a great foundation for it? And to my surprise, this is what came up and I'm gonna show you. I was like, and you know, this is pretty sad and I should never judge, but when I was younger, my girlfriend and I, Jocelyn, we used to make fun of like wet and wild. Like we'd always say, oh, it's, you know, really cheap and inexpensive. And you know, that's that was just us, you know, as younger girls, not really realizing, you know, sometimes there is quality in inexpensive products. It's not all about the name. So, and if she's watching, she'll laugh right now because we used to make fun of it all the time. Uh, and that's not right because I actually <laughs> look at, look at how things come back on you. Karma, right? Uh, I actually found this. Now, when I found this foundation, I looked up online, you know, four and a half stars on stars. There's my Boston accent stars on, um, YouTube, uh, on Amazon and, um, let me fix my camera here. Sorry. And this is what it is. You are going to freak out. Okay. Look at this. <laughs> look at that. It's wet and wild, but it's dewy foundation. It's like dewy. This one's called foundation wet and wild photo focus dewy lumina. And the color is golden beige. Okay. So I want to tell you something else here before you even put on foundation, girl, if you haven't done this, shame on you, especially if you've got like more mature skin, you have to do this. Um, Everybody always say, when I see these YouTube videos, I'd always say, oh God, I don't have all that time to go get all those products and run out and it's expensive and all that. But I really noticed a huge, I mean, huge, huge difference, huge, like Julia Roberts, difference in my skin as I apply my foundation on. Because every time I would get those crepey and like above the lips where you got, you know, the, the crepiness and it's just really gross. And here is another amazing product. And this is from e.l.f. And I've tried so many other face primers that cost me a fortune and they're all sitting where? Under my sink, not being used. But this right here is my lifesaver. This is my lifesaver. And if you're funny, if you go to Target or any of the Walmarts around here, it's always sold out in the bigger bottle. It comes in like five ounces and then 10 ounces. And this is only $5.99. And this is like putting butter, 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 butter on your face. And all I did was before I did, my actual, I'll, I showed you my, I'll show you my skin routine in the video. Um, but after I do all that, before I first start off, after my skin routine is done, I start off with this and I start off with the primer and the link to this primer. If you want to go and get it right now on Amazon is right on the bottom. You'll see the link. So you just click on that and go to this and it'll pull it right up for you. Order it. It'll come in within a day or day or two, whatever. And it's worth the money. It really is. But I just take, you know, here a couple of drops like so and I would go like all over now you gotta mind me I already did a full face of makeup so I'm just putting it on but even during the day like if you have a full face of makeup just to bring back like that moisture if you see some creepiness or cr you know creepiness or like all the flakiness coming around it actually evens it out so it's really really nice so I start off with that I blend it all in. I make sure I get around all my nose and you know, all my, around the neck area, even my area and all here. And this right here is a godsend. Seriously, I love it. And I sell Avon products and I'm showing you a bunch of other products that you can totally afford and not have to spend a fortune on, especially if you're like on a budget with the coronavirus and everything. This is awesome. Again, Amazon, bottom of the link, just check it out, click it on. It'll bring you right to your cart. And it is only $5.99, I believe. It's great. So these two are like so inexpensive and they do the trick for mature women for their skin. It's great. Um, in the video before you see this, um, you'll show me, you'll, I'll show you doing the, um, my skin routine, uh, screen, skin routine with my roller. And 
Uh, again, like I said, I fast forward it and the lighting's all crazy. So you have to bear with me. I'm kind of new. So we've got a little, we have uh, to sharpen up a few things here, if you, if you know what I mean. Uh, so yeah, so all these free pr products I have at the bottom of the link, if you want to go and get these. And if you're on a budget, man, I'm telling you, and if you don't, this is quick, right? So all you do is like, first you put this on all around your face and you could even, you can use a makeup sponge or you can use, some people like to use a brush. I start off with just, after I put the primer on, I will start off with my foundation, that wet and wild, and I'll go all the way down here. And then I start to come in here and then I stop. This is just me though. Everybody's got their own way of putting on. I've noticed that watching a million YouTube videos and I noticed there's so many ways to apply your uh, foundation. But with my skin being older now, I have to be careful about where I put it and how much I'm putting on because it can get so flaky and make you look older. So um, those are your choices and whatever you like. And besides, if you, if, like I said, if you are really quick and you say, oh, I put it on your fingers and I don't have enough money to go and spend a Sephora $18, well, you can get rid of these puppies at the dollar store a dollar store and I replace them or wash them only a dollar um yeah so you have to get those products I'm telling you I love them so after I put on my foundation uh, um uh, first first my primer then my foundation uh then I kind of like buff it all out and then I start with trying to take away all the foundation I always wondered and I've been doing a lot of research on this do I put my foundation on before or after my eyebrows I'm sorry my eyebrows it's 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 still up in the air for me do I do my eyebrows before my foundation or wait till afterwards well I notice for me if you don't want to sit there and take like forever to go in and out with a brush and try to like fine-tune the eyebrows so that they have the perfect start perfect arch or you know to try to get them so that it's not up and out and all that uh, I, I'm doing it now with putting all the foundation first and then taking a cloth and going through and wiping all the foundation off my eyebrows and then applying my eyebrows. Now, there is so many eyebrows, pencils, and products out there that I've gone through. And I have to say, this is probably one of my favorites, another one from Amazon. And what this is, is it's two eyeliners. They come in a pack and it's an eyebrow pencil and it's got a, uh, a top tip pencil and then a fill in for the bottom. Uh, and this is a great product. Uh, it's waterproof and smudge proof. And it's also on Amazon. Now it's $9.99, right? And it's called Music Flower. And it, there's two of them that come in a box. I wanna show you. So we've got this right here. And this is from Amazon. So you've got this part, which is really, 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 really thin. If you see it, really tiny. And then you've got the other part, which is an angle. So you get two of these and uh, the color that I have is like a light brown. And what it is, is they show you directions on how to use it. But you know, sometimes when people do certain things like your foundation application, it just doesn't come out the way you want it to. So with my case, I take off my foundation first. Now going back, I'm jumping all over the place here. Calm down. Uh, going back to well this is this is the part where okay so my primer's on first then my foundation right and then i wipe off my foundation on my eyebrows and then i take this and then i take the small end and i draw a line here at the bottom and then on the top i draw a line and then on this side i go in and then i just fill it fill it in and this is the result and it's great because I mean you're always trying to make your eyebrows even and it's really hard to do that but for ten dollars these last for a long time till you get two of these sticks right here again the Amazon link is at the bottom of the video so look at we're talking like still under thirty dollars all these products that I said that's low maintenance you could just throw it on right away so you got your primer right you throw it on then you've got your uh, foundation and then you go in and after you're done with your foundation, remember I told you to pat the primer from Milani right here underneath your eyes and all around. You can wait before you spray the whole face though. So you go in and you go in your eyebrows and you can get those two pencils like I said. These are awesome and it's under $10. So seriously, we're looking, this is 
12. I mean, we're still under $25 with all these products. This right here is $10 for two. And then there's also another product if you really want intense, like dramatic look and you really gonna pay attention to your eyebrows. I just got this and everybody was talking about, this is no, no big deal from people that are like in the makeup field and already know this. But me, I'm kind of low maintenance when it comes to that. Um, it's Anastasia Beverly Hills, you all know that. We see it on RuPaul's. They all use the makeup and they're amazing. The queens can really do really amazing makeup work. So uh, this is the little pomade that it comes in and mine's kind of like a little dirty right now. <laughs> So what I do is, this is kind of hard. You have to kind of get used to doing this because if you're not used to dramatic eyebrow, you have to be careful because you look, you can look crazy, like way too crazy. Um, but this also comes with like a little tip pen right there, see? So it's really thin and it also has with it. So these are two options I'm showing you. You can go with the Anastasia, more dramatic, which is great. This, this actually I paid, I believe it's $35? I don't know. No, don't quote me. But this is also in the link too. This is a little bit more money. Um, and if you want to spend a little bit more time. But with this, um, you can really, and you have to take your time too. You draw it up and then draw it. In. And then I go back over and I take, I go to the dollar store again. I take another brush and then I just pull away all the areas that have smudged or aren't lining up so I do that so like I said dollar store uh, Amazon really really inexpensive products and uh, for my mascara I use um, the old faithful great lash I go on and off don't you probably change mascaras too it's good to go and change your mascaras and makeup uh, and check it out you know uh, like as far as hair hair products and all that too uh, but I also like combine the colossal too from Maybelline and I just got Lady Gaga's um, liquid eyelash shimmer, which I love because it was having a, like a Monday Amazon Black Friday and it was on sale for $10 and I absolutely love it. And this color, I believe is a purple passion. Oh, good Lord, I should have had to read it down. I don't, I'm gonna put it in the link below, but it was it's normally like $20 or $18 and I got it for 10 and I just got it the other day and I love it. Now look at how my upper lids as I come down, you really can't see it, but it pops, my eye pops, right? As you get older, you wanna do more on the top of the lids. As I researched makeup artists and what they tell you. And then also, um, I had it, I have a light uh, eyeshadow liquid that I use for NYX. And that's a light beige brown. And I'll show you that in one second. Anyways, hope you guys are doing good, this ain't safe. It was like crazy for Thanksgiving. I didn't get to make it home, unfortunately. Uh, but this is the other uh, liquid eyeshiner that I really high, liquid eye gel, liquid eyeshadow gel, <laughs> duh, that I love. It's it's NYX. I got it at Target, but you can get it at Amazon. I'm going to buy it on Amazon. I love to just get stuff from Amazon. And now that they have this new buy $35 and get it like between the hours of like one and like, like two in the morning and like one in the afternoon, I just ordered like the new foundation and the primer and i got it the next day at like 10 o'clock in the morning or the night before anyways that's where i got lady gaga so this is amazing lady gaga so you can see it it stays on longer it's got a little bit of a shimmer it's not too over the top and it's really pretty and it goes on really nice and then i put a little bit of it underneath my eye too so I really, really like all these two. So I just want to go over that. So look, now, if you just did this really, really quick, and then you push your eyeshadow on, and then you put your mascara on, we're talking like out the door, right? Because I didn't go into detail about, okay, so I'm going to also take a, um, you know, we're gonna sit there and we're gonna, we're gonna sit there and start to do, uh, do, uh, excuse me, hold on one second. <laughs> <laughs> okay so i'm just gonna put a little bit of blush on sorry i have like a little like left in here i just want to like get a little contour i'm sorry oh my god i just totally forgot <laughs> what i'm like what is that pencil called contour <laughs> get it together I have one too and I use it when I have the time and we can go over that but this is so basic and low maintenance right 
and it's affordable. It's all under $30. Well, the Lady Gaga was 10, so I'm talking about under $50 with the mascara. And uh, that's it, there you go. Uh, so, um, that is the basic low maintenance, really inexpensive, pretty good damn quality products. Um, like I said, I did that misting spray at the end to do, once I was all done with that makeup, I ended up doing the Milani spray all over my, all over me, as when I was done. But before that, I wanted to add a little bit more color where we're talking here. And, uh, so, um, yeah, so I hope your Thanksgiving was great. The holidays or seasons are coming up and you really have to check out the, you really have to, I mean, if you're an older woman and you're looking, oh, I put too much on now, crazy and you're looking for like the less creepiness, put this on before any foundation. If you found the right foundation, you found the right foundation, we'll put this on underneath it. That's great, but I swear by this, it is great. And this Wet n Wild is my favorite. I would take this over Laura Mercier. And I've used that product for a long time. Okay, well, thanks for tuning in. And um, next week, we're gonna go over a few things. Uh, on uh, how to stay and feel younger. So thanks for tuning in again. I really appreciate it. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe so when my next video comes out, you'll be notified. Thanks again. Have a great week. Okay, guys, thanks a lot. Have a good night. Bye.